Hey guys, I'm Lloyd and I'm with Design Wall. We're going to be showing you how to install MAMP and MAMP Pro so that you can develop your WordPress site locally. There are many reasons why you should do it this way. One, you don't need to be connected to the internet. Two, you can work from anywhere, regardless of whether or not there's an internet connection. But most importantly, you don't have to constantly update your website while you're still developing it. That will destroy user experiences. Thank you and I hope you enjoy the video. One of the first things you'll need to do is download the appropriate software. In order to get your website up and running, you have to get it. The first thing you'll need to do is go to wordpress.org. Here you can find a free download. WordPress is famous five minute installation. Nice. You download the zip file, and then you'll need one more piece of software in order to get your website locally hosted. MAMP. There's a MAMP free and a MAMP pro version. We're gonna get the free version. Awesome. You go to MAMP and you find the download icon. Nice. Once your download is complete, Go to your downloads folder, unzip the package, and then follow the installation instructions. Continue, continue, agree, install. You might be prompted to enter password and then enter it. Once the installation is complete, your server will be ready. MAMP and MAMP Pro have been installed successfully. Now let's check to make sure that it works. You go to application, MAMP. At this point, you'll be prompted to enter your password. Just go ahead and enter it, then launch MAMP. If you go into preferences, you can see the different types of settings that are available. There's start and stop, ports, in this case it's A888, PHP, and web server. We'll hit OK, and then we'll just start the server. If you've done it successfully, when you hit Start Server, a MAMP page will appear. Welcome! MAMP has been installed successfully. Check that MAMP installation once again. Go to localhost, semicolon, 8888, and you'll see index of, forward slash. Now because this page is loaded, you can see that your installation is successful. At this point, we need to go ahead and install WordPress. Your first website using WordPress. You need to go back to your downloads folder, copy the WordPress installation zip file, go to applications, MAMP, HT docs, and paste the WordPress installation zip into this folder. Unzip it, and now you're ready to go. At this point, you should go ahead and rename it to whatever you like. We're gonna name this one portfolio since we're building a portfolio page. And now you can see that when we refresh the page, that it's right there. Portfolio and the WordPress zip. We'll click on it, and bam, you can see that it works. If you're anything like the normal person, your first installation won't go smoothly. You'll forget something. I personally forgot to create a database. So I'm gonna walk you through that. At this point, your username will be root, and password will be root because that's the default setting for WordPress. We'll rename the database portfolio, click submit, and wow, we can, we can see that it can't select the database. What's gone wrong here? Let's check again, localhost semicolon 888 works, portfolio works, and we don't know what the issue is. We'll open the web start page, scroll down, and then go to PHP my admin. We need to create a database. Click the databases tab in the, in the top, create a new database, enter your name, and then you'll see on the left hand side, portfolio. Now let's go ahead and try this one again. Localhost 8888, portfolio, English, continue, let's go. Rename it to portfolio, the database, username root, password root, and hit submit. Now we're ready to run the install. 
At this point, you can give your site a title, select your username, and enter a password. Confirm the use of your password. In my case, it's weak. And then enter your email address. You don't want to check that box because you want people to find your website. Now you can log in. Primetime Tran, remember me because I'm going to be using this quite often. Log in. And bam, we've got our first WordPress site up and running locally. Look up top localhost semicolon 8888 portfolio wp admin index.php. Let's check out the website. Hello world, welcome to WordPress. This is your first post. Congratulations, you successfully installed MAMP, WordPress, and got your first website locally hosted. Thanks for taking the time to watch this video. Remember to like and subscribe if you want to stay in tune for more.